Good morning, everybody. How y'all doing today? That's wonderful. Let's get into it. Okay, yesterday I was able to uh, see a leaked list for Street Fighter 6 DLC Season 2 characters. Uh, we don't know if it's true. We don't know if it's, you know, obviously it's, if it's fake or whatever, or it's a, a you know, to throw us off the trail. Um, we don't know. But I would like to talk about it and my, my personal views of each and every last character that is in there. Okay, we're going to talk about that. Um, no, I'm not doing no videos, no overlays, no nothing. This is straight me off the hip, one take day. And I'm going to go, let's get started, shall we? Okay, um, actually the list was deleted off of Reddit. Um, I did take a screenshot of it, but I don't want to put it on here. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to put a mosaic over the people's names. I'm just going to talk about what I saw. And so far, the six characters, there's a brand new male character. Bison, Sakura, Rainbow Mika, Elena, who else? Bison, Vega, Sakura, Rainbow Mika, Elena, and a new character. Yeah, six characters. And this season, there's supposed to be six characters added. Okay. Um. So far, they're probably going to show it soon. Probably like, you know, probably like in May, show the characters or, you know, teasers or whatever. Maybe these characters, maybe even other new characters. You know what I'm saying? Capcom is, you know, Capcom is doing what Capcom does. Anyway. Um. Overall, I don't like this list. I don't like none of the characters. I'll explain one by one why I don't like none of the characters. Um, also, if you see my video that's on my you know, that's on this page, uh, ten characters that I think needs to be added to Street Fighter Six as a whole. Um, no, none of the ten characters are on this list, and also um, this is only for season two. So the ten characters that I named can still show up within Street Fighter 6 that's why I did that video as far as the shelf life because honestly I knew that none of those characters that I mentioned in the 10 characters in that video were going to show up in season 2 but I you know I can hope I wish that at least one or maybe two maybe even one was going to show up on the on the on the leak list but we don't we don't know we don't know this is all conjecture right now at this point in time but my personal view of each said character in that rumored list is I'm disappointed, not appalled, not upset, just disappointed because, okay, let's go with the first one, Bison, Dictator. Um, Capcom, you, you can't let, let him go. He, he's dead. He, you're, you're getting to the point where SNK can't let go of Geese Howard now. Bison is dead. The storyline is dead. Can we let go Shadow Lou? Did you not forget that your third game, third strike, you, still, you started the Illuminati story arc right after Shadow Lou? But we keep going back to Shadow Loop. And then in Street Fighter uh, 5, and now in 6, you starting a new arc called the uh, Neo Shadow Loop arc. And can we focus on that? Can we focus on Illuminati? Can we focus on Neo Shadow Loop? Why are we still talking about Shadow Loop? Why? Why are we still talking about Bison? Let him go. He's dead. Let him go. Tired of him. Don't get me wrong. His kit, aka his move list, phenomenal. Love Bison as a character. I wish that y'all bring back Paint the Fence that he added in Capcom vs. SNK. Who? But you won't. But other than that, story wise, let him go. He's dead. Move on. Next character, Sakura. I can't take credit for this joke. Somebody put it on rem uh, on uh, Reddit. Tired of Diet Shotos. How many Diet Shotos? Sakura, Sean, Diet Shotos. We're tired of them. Now, granted, Sean is cool. You need to bring him back because he needed redemption art. You know what I'm saying? You made him a joke character in Third Strike. He was the, the best character in Double Impact. But, I mean, come on. Now, Sean deserves to be better. Bring back into Street Fighter 6 versus Sakura. I'm tired of Sakura. I'm tired of the Mary Sue of Street Fighter universe. She's not even Ryu's student or protege. She just happened to see him in a street fight one time. And now she can throw plasma like him? Now she can DP like him? Come on, man. Capcom, her whole storyline is garbage. I do not like Sakura. The only person that 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 made Sakura look even decent was Sakunoko and Trish G in Street Fighter 4. Excuse me. Take her out. 
tired of that character. Next character is uh, Vega. Now, give me wrong. Look. We are a herd community in the FGC. We're abused. We're an abused herd comedy. We're a uh, community. We're a sheep. And the wolves is uh, the developers. And they've been messing with us for since the beginning of the FGC. And let me tell you something. A lot of the herd did not want none of these characters. Only character specialists wanted these characters. You know what I'm saying? And don't don't get don't get me started. Some of these people are like, I'm not a character specialist, but I would like to see them in the game. Yeah, you like to see them in the game for aesthetics, or you know, because they you know they wearing thongs like Armika, or you know what I'm saying. You just like to see them, but you won't play with them. You won't take them to tournaments offline or on. So I don't know why you want these characters in here if you're not a character specialist for said character. Y'all just talking out the side of y'all necks like I normally do. Now moving on to Armika. The reason why people want her in the game is because she half naked, but Capcom is getting rid of all their half naked skins for certain characters. So Armika that you think you're gonna see, you're not gonna see. Okay? And then second of all, if you if your name is not El Choque, if your name ain't oh, oh my god is Andre, if your name ain't Fudo, you, you basically People who've done or used her at tournaments and got results, then you don't need to talk because you're not a Arch Arch you're not a Rainbow Mika player. You may be a casual, but you're not a diehard tournament player. And you, you know, you know, your your um your opinion is valid is invalid because nobody wants our Mika. There's so many characters in the Street Fighter Final Fight universe, or Rival Schools universe that needs to be added into Street Fighter 6 versus our Mika. No, come on now. Nothing gave me more pleasure in Street Fighter 5 of me with as an Alex main beating our Mika player, players. That character is is garbage. She was garbage in Alpha Series. She's garbage in Street Fighter 5 and she'll be garbage in Street Fighter 6. There I say it. Moving on. Vega players. I, I think I was going on Vega, but I just went to Armika to run out. Ran out strong. Like I said, one take one take Dave. Not editing none of this. This is straight off the hip. Okay, back to claw, claw players. Claw enthusiasts. There's two types of um, character enthusiasts or character specialists that that uh, live and die by their characters, and that's Hakan mains and Claw mains. Claw mains, more specifically, number one in Street Fighter. I've never seen more loyal uh, uh, character character mains in all of Street Fighter. You know, um, when Street Fighter Five, when uh, when Vega was announced, you know, people was like, "Oh yeah, yeah." You know, I talked to Jeremy Luger. Jeremy Luger was, "Oh yeah, 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 yeah." Can't wait. And then he tried them. He's like, "They just destroyed my boy." They destroyed him. I'm not using him. And now he's in Street Fighter 6. He's playing Jamie. Then he tried to. He was like, "Okay, oh, wait, the Ed come out. Let me see what Ed is." He can't, he, Ed came out. He's like, "Don't like him." He said, they, "But he said he liked the Jamie updates." And he was like, "Um." And then he was like, "I'm gonna try to use Akuma." And Akuma come out. Then yesterday, this uh, I got the information. I called him, and he was like, "This is his exact quote." He told me. I was like, "So, what do you think about come on? You see the? You see the? Uh, you see the elite list? He said, I'm holding my enthusiasm until I see and actually play with him. I'm not going to fall for the Oakley Doke like I did in Street Fighter V. And I'm not saying he's speaking for all Claw mains, but I'm just saying all Claw mains feel his uh, his same, uh, feel just like he feels. I mean, Zeus the same way. Zeus was all hyped for uh, um, in Street Fighter V, and then he was like, mm, you know what I'm saying? So. <laughs> I mean, there's no hinder with Claw. I mean, I just think there's other characters that deserve to be in the game more so than, than Claw. Okay? Um, so we went over Bison, we went over Sakura, we went over uh, Claw. Who else? Oh. Who else is in, who else is in, in the game? Uh, Elena. Yeah, Elena. Me as an Elena main slash Alex main from Street from Third Strike. Um, what are we doing? What's, what, what's, look, okay, Capcom is like, yeah, we 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 understand. There's no Third Strike representative or no uh, Street Fighter Three character representative in this game, so we're gonna bring uh, Elena in the game. And let me tell you something. Nobody wanted Elena. Nobody wanted Elena. Not main character. Nobody wanted Elena. Look, look. One A was Dudley. One B was Makoto. The most requested, the, the two most requested uh, third strike characters ever. You know what I'm saying? People was like Yanni Yang, but Jamie's in the game, so we get Yanni Yang may not show up in the game. So they're not really requested, but Makoto and Dudley was 
if I request it, okay? That's tier one. Tier two is Remy and Necro. Everybody wanted them, maybe even 12, but you know, nobody's really stressing for 12. But Alex and, and Remy, people was like, yeah, we want them in the game. But nobody, nobody except Mina RD and maybe Justin Wong wants Elena in goddamn Street Fighter 6. Okay? Nobody wants her. Nobody hurts. Hell, half the hurt, excuse my language, the hurt in Street in, uh, in the FGC is still suffering from Vietnam flashbacks or PTSD from Ultra Street Fighter 4 due to her. You know what I'm saying? Nobody want her in the game. I don't even think Sakonoko want her in the game. Did Sakonoko play, uh, yeah, he played her. And Gamer B. Gamer B played her, uh, in Street Fighter 4 too. But nobody wants Elena. Come on now, man. What are we doing, Capcom? What are we doing? Anyway. So, Bison, Vega, Sakura, Armika, Elena, and the new character. And he's like, what's your beef with the new character? He's a new character. I don't have no beef per se with the character but in the in the leak list it said he looks middle eastern or african descent and come on now capcom so that further lets me know that he's probably a descendant of egypt from egypt or north africa maybe or the middle east and if he's from north africa nine times out of ten he's from egypt and nine times out of ten he's gonna be light complexion he's not gonna be dark skin he's dark dark complexion so he's gonna be light skin he's not gonna be dark skin and he's from africa it may be from africa and we're not even gonna talk about that that's a whole new video i'm gonna talk about as far as a black gamer as far as the nerf and buffs of black characters in the favorite games i play i'll talk about that in a whole another video and it's gonna be deep but i just wanted to do this uh this rant out real quick because Capcom, come on, bro. Come on. What are we doing? We you know what I'm saying. Like I said, these these are this is a leaked rumor list. This is probably not even 100% accurate. This is probably not even 35% accurate. But this is my first reaction, my first impression, and this is Jedi doo doo. You know what I'm saying? Jedi poodoo. It's just no. We're not. We're not. Mm -mm, mm -mm. And, I, and you're probably going to see some other videos. And you're probably going to see some other people be like, I love the list. I like the list. I enjoy the list. But they're not going to main those characters. So, you know what I'm saying? Let's I'm, you know, let's keep it real. Let's keep it a buck. Real rap, as Triforce used to say. Real rap. Real freaking rap. None of these people like these characters. They just jump in on the bandwagon and like to see how they will play in Street Fighter 6. But none of them are going to bring in them tournaments. Outside of the character specialist that I named specifically, nobody's going to be using these characters in tournaments. Come on now, maybe a new up and coming uh, uh, pro gamer, maybe. But other than that, I don't I, I, look, y'all. Yeah, this is such heroic nonsense. Your false sense of bravado. Nobody really liked these characters. I'm outside of Bison and I'm outside of Claw, but the other, the other, uh, the other three, nobody liked those characters like that. Not like that. Over Makoto, Dudley, Remy, Alex. You know what I'm saying? Fay Long? No, nobody liked those characters like that. Let's keep it real. Let's keep it 100%. Nobody likes them damn characters. Like I said, people like Bison. You know what I'm saying? People like uh, Claw. That's cool. Even people that don't use them. But nobody... Come on, dog. You mean you tell me if you had the option to get uh, Sagat over Armika, you pick Armika? Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh.